What does a soul tie dream mean? What is a soul tie dream? It is a dream where you see yourself meeting another person's soul. You can read each other's minds without having to speak. The strange dream may seem romantic, but it has nothing to do with it. Loneliness happens to everyone, and it would feel good to have someone you could connect with spiritually. The dream is about a spiritual bond. It is not about religion. It is about two people believing they have a kindred spirit, such that words are no longer necessary. Just sensing the person is enough to understand them. A soulmate in daily life connotes romance, but spiritual bonds go beyond this. It means that two hearts are in harmony. The more they share, the more they grow. Soulmates don't have to be in a romantic relationship. The age, gender, or location do not count when it comes to soulmates. To get an interpretation, look at the energy and the person's spirit. They come together because you share a deep understanding of each other. Even if the person is from centuries ago and met him in his books, you could still be soulmates. Your soul is indicating how powerful their lives relate to your day to day experiences. You that can also be an influence on people who will come after you. It is hard for people to accept this idea because it is at odds with their perspective. But spiritual energy has no boundaries. Focus on the force that touches us in a deeply profound way that people only get through their dreams. The key to understanding soul ties is to stop trying. Learning to stop trying to understand is difficult, but when you accept that you know nothing and give in, you get clarity. Soul ties are energetic connections. There is something that stirs within you. You could experience familiar feelings even though you cannot describe them. Have you ever listened to a song that reminded you of a feeling? That is how soul ties work. They are not precise. You receive signals from the universe. Your spirit is telling you that you receive signals from the universe. It offends some people who believe in rational thought. You have to stop using the same tools everyone uses and forget this thinking. This is not an easy thing. We are all empty, which is why our soul yearns for connection. You may have people around you, but the truth is you are on your own. When you think of death, it becomes clear. This thought terrifies many. Some people believe in heaven just because they fear hell. But fear is a cruel master. Why desiring something out of fear is not a good thing. Others act in desperation, while others give up. This resignation changes the pulse they emit to the universe. And guess how the universe responds? It bounces back the signal. They feel useless. Watch your signals. Soul ties are like a broadcasting tower on a hill. Your actions are sent out to the universe and will come back to you. Small acts can cause a ripple that affects you. It is the butterfly effect. Your little actions could trigger bigger things. Learn to be patient and also speak gently to those around you. You reap what you sow. If you want people to be good to you, treat them right. Cheer them. Let your actions speak. You have to sow the right seeds. However long it takes, you eventually get what you deserve. Finally, there are thoughts. One may think that thoughts don't count, but they do. You become what you consistently think. If you're thinking of how useless you are, this is what will happen to you. The image you are implanting into your mind is going to come true. It will change your behavior and make the results visible. Stop looking at yourself as a failure. Know that you are in control, and do something about it. Soul ties can help us achieve the life we desire. When two transmission centers relay signals, they strengthen the message. They also use the information they receive. Unfortunately, many think getting a soulmate would make them whole. This is not true. You don't need a soulmate to complete you. Your soulmate is complete, just as you need to be. Soulmates act as a mirror, not a treasure map. Your soulmate's real value. Instead of looking for a savior, get to know yourself better. It is hard. When you wake up, you are under pressure to put on your role quickly to get through the day. You have to pretend to get what you want until you don't realize when you're lying to yourself. When you have someone who speaks the truth to you, you can make the right changes. You ask yourself if you are happy with the person in the mirror. If not, you make a change. You begin to think of the sacrifices you need to make to get what you want. In life, people like to be cared for. They have a sense of entitlement that didn't end in childhood. As Carl Jung put it, you're just taking care of your basic needs such as food, sex, and shelter. When you connect with your soulmate you can see exactly where you are. You get to choose who you become. Once you say where you are going, it goes to the universe, and your life begins to transform. It will happen because you are self-aware. It is hard to see ourselves without a mirror.
A soulmate helps us see through the lies we have woven.